Welcome back everyone to the morning announcements. My name is Ali Abdul Seder. Today is Monday, September 27th, 2021. Picture day is today. You will be taking pictures during your language arts class. If you would like to purchase your pictures, please complete your picture order form with your payments and bring it with. Homecoming parade. Grab your club, grab your classmates. Time to make banners and floats. Next Friday, 4.30 to 5.30, come out and join or watch. The theme is art gallery, so be creative and show off your skills. An environmental club and the People for Palestine Club are looking for new members. See Mr. Sabra if you are interested in joining. Interact is holding their first meeting tomorrow, September 28th. Stop by the cafeteria at 3 p.m. if you want to join. If anyone would like to join book club, their first meeting will be held on Wednesday, September 29th in room C204. And to join their remind, text at BCFHS to 81010. Poetry Club is also holding their first meeting this week. It will be on Thursday, September 30th at 3 in the library. They have the same remind code as the book club. Congrats to Mr. K, who won the Teacher of the Year Award. The whole school is very proud. Be on the lookout for our school newspaper, TikTok, Twitter, and Instagram. The links are in the description below. With that being said, see you next time. The Almuda Murhad Teacher of the Year Award is a district-wide award meant to highlight the teacher that has been nominated. Today I have with me Mr. K, our very own AP Physics and Physics teacher. How are you, Mr. K? Congratulations on winning the award. Thank you. How do you feel about winning the Teacher of the Year Award? I am very grateful. I am so happy and so excited to win this award. And I wasn't expecting, but I am so happy that I won the award. What do you think you did that so many students nominated you this time? Well, uh, when I won the award, after I won the award, then I thought about it. I thought, what did I do to win the award? But then I remembered that online, when we were online, and I figured probably for my AP classes, or one AP class, that some students probably thought it was a cool thing, but to me it was just something that I need to do. The, to review before the AP exam. And I was recording lessons for them over the weekend, and they were around two to three hour lessons for solving problems. And sending it through Zoom so kids can watch it and do good on the AP exam. Now, to me, it's just something I need to do because I used to do it even the years before, but in school. And to some students, maybe they felt, you know, they want something that was nice to do. Maybe that's the reason, probably, why I could have won the award for that reason. Oh, yeah. Thinking about it right now. <laughs> All right. Do you have any words you would like to say to the student body? Uh, well, I'm gonna say keep working hard. You know, it's tough times, but let's just keep working hard and do your thing, and hopefully everything gets better. And hopefully next year will be a much better year than this year. But let's just try our best for this year. All right. Thank you so much, Mr. K. Humble as always, and he really is one of the greatest teachers. Thank you so much.